All right, so this video is gonna talk about gaming. At uh, first, I, 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 I was like making a, I was actually just doing a gaming, uh, my gaming history thing, but I'm like, I don't really know if there's a really point, like the systems I've owned and stuff. So I guess we'll just think how, how we feel about gaming, maybe why I do it, generally speaking. Well, at a point, at a point of my life, like, uh, I would say, Interactions with people weren't really great, I guess you could say. But it wasn't always fun. It wasn't always easy to find people to hang out with. So, you know, think, thanks to video games, they had the single player and AI. I mean, you you could you could have you could find entertainment by yourself. And that's that's what I had. I didn't own a I didn't own a computer until years later. But um, yeah, you know. Video games have interesting stories, the interactivity, things that just draw you in. So when I didn't have people to, to be around, I had something that kept me happy during really, really shitty times in my life where I had to, had to deal with people I really, really, really didn't want to be around. You know, and thanks to gaming, especially RPGs, I... I was the best in my class for for reading, reading and anything to do with English because you know, while they're outside running around playing tag, hide and go seek or whatever the hell, whatever the hell others do. Sport Oh yeah, sports too, I guess sports. I I was t technically learning through through a fictional form of entertainment that a lot of people consider worthless. So um yeah, it's good memories. So I would say, you know, like uh middle and high school gaming was uh gaming well elementary school gaming was used this was fun middle and high school it was used to a mix of get out of depression and yeah a mix of getting out of depression to uh just being just distracted and uh you know now i'm i'm currently tw 28 years old and uh I'm, I I pretty much mostly use anime and video games as something to get my mind off of how much life sucks. Life's boring. There's just no there's no point to it, despite what anybody may say. You get up, you go to work, you get paid. You know, you just do that until you die, and you'll die eventually. So whatever, you know, you, your body's only at at the prime up until somewhere between thirty to fifty, and then you just start going downhill. So it's like you have a really short short span of, of freedom because you've like about eight, 18 or some odd years old, you're finally able to get freedom. See, but really short span. But anyway, not get back on topic. It, game, gaming, gaming for me is something to just focus, get my mind off of how shitty things are. You know, I and actually should add that I've I've played games since I was four years old. I started with the original NES system. I've not killed or particularly harmed anybody else, so that says fuck all to all those people that say, well, games teach you how to hack or kill or all this other bullshit. No, it's not the video games that do this shit. I've played violent video games since I was a damn child. But video games are things that relieve people from this. It's the it's the life problems, it's the parents, it's the education system, it's the fucking bullies, it's the it's the it's the laws, it's you know the everything everything else everything that creates pressure. Video games do not create pressure, I know, because I've been doing it for years. It relieves it, it distracts it. It doesn't teach me to do bad things. I've, in fact, you know what? Speaking of that, I've actually learned morals. I mean, I don't want to go into particularly detail about it. I mean, I don't really have a problem talking about it, but you know, it is what it is. I wasn't raised in a way. I wasn't really raised in uh. Raised in, raised in a proper way, which teaches me right and wrong. I was kind of treat. I was treated badly during times I didn't deserve it. So, you know, RPGs like uh, Final Fantasy VII, for example, because it's popular, you know, I was one of the ones that owned it when I was, when I was younger. I do own it now, but anyway. It, you know, they portray, they always portray the good and bad side. Like, 
you're, what you're doing and what you're doing is right you're trying to stop this person then you see what that person is doing and then it's associated with being wrong so i personally think that video games have taught me um the ge generalized moral concepts of right and wrong i don't know where i'd be without them maybe i wouldn't be here maybe i'd be in jail i don't know but the point point is I hate the media and I hate people that shit on video games and blame them for any negative problem that happens because that's not realistic. It's just it's just fucking not. Um so I guess ending the video, the question for the viewers. How do you um uh, main questions, how do you how do you feel about video games? How how did you get into video games? Uh, and you know, other stuff like what kind of games you like? How often do you play? How important it is to you? Do you know people that do it? Etc. Whatever you want to talk about. If uh, th Thank you for spending the time watching me talk a this rant about what I like. Have a good, have a good day.